Today, you can consider Payment Cloud your gateway to payment gateways. A payment gateway captures, verifies, secures, and communicates online card transactions. Cards taken in person utilize a point of sale system to accept transactions. Think of a box that you swipe, tap, or dip your card in. Online sales utilize a payment gateway to do the same thing. Additionally, payment gateways help protect against fraud. Before we get into the specifics of how payment gateways work, give me 20 seconds to explain these two terms that you need to know to understand how payment gateways work. Time starts now. A payment processor is the financial institution responsible for the transfer of funds from your customer's issuing bank to yours, whereas a virtual terminal is the digital interface that you use to manually input your customer's card information. Essentially, a virtual terminal is a specific feature of a payment gateway, but not the same thing. 1923. One. To make an online purchase, either a customer enters their card information through a shopping cart or a payment page, or the merchant, that's you, enters the card information on the payment gateway's virtual terminal. Two, the payment gateway then verifies the customer's name, billing address, expiration date, and security code to help detect and prevent fraud. Three, once verified, the payment gateway secures the transaction data and sends it to the payment processor. Four, the payment processor then communicates the secure transaction data through the relevant card brand network to the customer's issuing bank, which either approves or denies the transaction. The payment processor then sends the bank's response to the payment gateway, which lets the customer know if the purchase was successful. By the way, all this happens in a few seconds. Are payment gateways secure? Yeah. That's the whole point. Now, let's review the standard security features utilized by payment gateways. And to make it less dull, data encryption. Data encryption converts information into encoded text that can only be accessed with a key. Number two, tokenization. Tokenization takes encryption to the next level by breaking up and replacing sensitive data with non-sensitive tokens accessible only through a tokenized mapping system. This is confusing. So let's imagine we're at a casino. I hand the cashier a $10 bill. Here you go, sir. Thank you. I'm given a chip. This chip represents $10, but only at the casino. Otherwise, it has no real value. That is until I hand the chip back to the cashier, who exchanges it for $10. Think of your dollars as your sensitive data, the chip as the non-sensitive token, and the cashier as the tokenized mapping system. Do you only want to accept cash in person for the rest of your life? Do you want to accept online payments online for your online e-commerce business online? Okay, good. Look, I can go on for hours citing stats about the popularity of online purchases, but in reality, it's very simple. People buy things online, and if you want to sell things online, you need a payment gateway. That's it. No one likes talking about money. And I know that because it's my job. But we're going to talk about money, specifically how much money a payment gateway will cost you. This is probably not going to be what you want to hear, because I'm sure you want a concrete number, but payment gateway costs are determined on a case-by-case -case basis, with a variety of factors affecting the final price. Total gateway costs include, but are not limited to, standard monthly fees, a per-transaction fee, batch-out fee, plus fees for any add-ons or premium features. You started a business so you can make money, but as the old saying goes, you got to spend money on a payment gateway to make money. Online. Now that you know everything you need to know about payment gateways, let's talk about how to choose one. Here are a few features that we find most effective for our clients. You forgot about online virtual terminal, the built-in one? Thank you. As you can see, it can get complicated quickly. For even more in-depth information about payment gateways, check out our blog post linked in the description. It's a real deep dive. If you're ready to go, click the link up here or below to fill out a quick form to get started with Payment Cloud today. Thanks so much for watching our video. If you liked us, give us a like, 
subscribe here. And if you have any questions on anything Payment Gateway related or merchant services, hit us up in the comments below. Have a great day. You need a Payment Gateway. Then you need a Payment Gateway. You need a Payment Gateway. Stop denying. You need a Payment Gateway. You need a Payment Gateway.